Good morning, Piscianos. Good morning. I hope you guys had a good night's sleep. I hope you woke up today feeling happy, safe, and peaceful. Thank you to everyone that has liked, commented, subscribed, and gave donations. All right, Piscianos. Ooh, excuse me. I just had my coffee. Okay, so. I heard a song. It was a John Legend song. It goes, my head's under water, but I'm breathing fine. I'm so sorry. You're crazy and I'm out of my mind. Cause all of me loves all of you. Na 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 Give your all to me. I'll give my all to you. You're my end and my beginning. Even when I lose, I'm winning. Cause I give you all. Oh, 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 of me. And you give me all, oh, 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 of you. Give me all of you. This song is definitely talking about two people who have an incredible bond. I mean, it is, it's something deep. It's like one of those bonds, Pisces, where, I don't know, you may think about this person and then next thing you know, they call you. Uh, maybe you don't sleep well in the night and you're fine. Your life's doing good, but you find out that they were having difficulties that night. You know, so your spirit couldn't let you rest because of that connection, that bond that you have. This absolutely can be with children. Um, I do have the death card here. This could be with somebody that has crossed over to the other side. You might be receiving messages from your deceased loved ones. Um, um, for a lot of you, Pisces, this might just be, you know, God talking to you at this moment. You know, like maybe you've had a lot of disappointments with people and the way you give people love and the way you give people loyalty and you it you you haven't they don't know how to reciprocate that to you so i feel like that's god calling you and saying give it all to me you know and i'll give it all to you type of feeling pisces so take that how it resonates um for a lot of you i do feel something about a connection here on the earth that might have a third party or somebody that's in the way um, getting that also with the death card Pisces I don't know let's go a little bit deeper because I'm not all the way there somebody that's getting in the way of this deep connection all right spirit angels ancestors and higher beings please help me with this message today for my beautiful pipe seeds people my Piscianos what messages do we have for Pisces I just saw the four of wands but it didn't pop out and I saw the Page of Cups as well. Strength, the Hermit. I just felt that it's taking everything that someone has to stay grounded, to stay peaceful, to stay in a place of calm, to not let someone take you out of character is the feeling that I'm getting here. The Strength in the Reversal, the Hermit and the Two of Swords. Mm, it's not easy, you know? Uh, there's a person that might be testing you you know, um, that's the feeling, like somebody that might be testing you. Um, my head's under water, but I'm breathing fine. I'm so sorry. So the feeling is, Pisces, that it is a situation that you're supposed to be drowning in, but you're not drowning, are you? You know, you're not drowning. I feel this, Pisces. You know, um, this world is simulation. You know, these people are not real I know it sounds crazy these problems are not real you know I know it feels real right like how you gonna pay your bills you know like I get it 
you know, um, but they're not real Pisces. The only thing that's real is the light that you have inside of us, is your connection with God, with source, you know, um, and I, I, so it doesn't matter if somebody is stepping in the way of, of between you and someone else or you and something that you want in life. You know, we know that sooner or later, God will clear the way. You know, there's something that's going to come in and just change all that for you. This could definitely be a deceased loved one that is working on the other side for you. You know, I don't know. But let's go deeper. Spirit, tell me more about this strength in reverse. You're doing a lot of soul searching. You might be in a place of like hermiting. Hermiting meaning like, like keeping to yourself. Um, I think because maybe people are testing you. Ooh. You know, sometimes when you have a very close connection to someone, their negativity or whoever they allow into their lives affect yours as well. So I don't know if you've already noticed that, that someone that you have a deep bond to has brought in someone else with a lot of negative energy and it's affecting you. So you're pulling back right now. That's the energy. I mean, like I'm pulling back. Let me get more self-control. Let me, let me like uh, tame myself, you know, type of feeling. Like, let me, let me start really assessing why this person is pulling my energy away from me or the way that I like this energy to look like. You know, that's what I'm getting here. But let's go deeper. Spirit, tell me more about this strength card. Tell me more about this strength card. You know what um, is coming to mind, Pisces? Knight of Cups. For whatever reason, I'm thinking about my cousin. And... She's with, her husband is terrible. He's a narcissist. And um, I was thinking about one Christmas, this was like two Christmases ago, where she, she, um, she saw like the kids drive, like where they were giving donations and you know, they're very fortunate, they have a lot. And she has, her kids have a ton of toys they have never even opened. And so she was like, I'm, that's it. You know, I saw the donation. I felt the calling to do something. So let me go and donate all those unopened toys and stuff. And so she, she was going to do that. And she spoke it out loud to this person, to her husband. And, you know, she was in the, the mood. She felt the Holy Spirit coming over her, telling her, you know, important information on what she should be doing. And, you know, her husband, the narcissist, winded up saying, you want to give away all the kids toys? And we were both like, what? Like, because I heard it too. I was on the phone with her when it was happening and she was telling me what she was doing and everything. And then to hear that was like such a, uh, you know, I don't know if it was like a buzz kill, not a buzz kill, but it was just like a, I, I don't even know how to explain it. Like, it was just like, wh what are you talking about? You know, how are you painting this person that's being sincere and trying to do something from the heart as doing something negative towards her family or to her own children that was such a manipulative game that he played right there he's a narcissist so trust me i don't know why that story just came to mind but it did maybe you guys have a similar story i don't know but let's go into the cards all right so we have the strength knight of cups in reverse and the ace of pentacles so something that i was feeling here about is like learning to show loyalty to the people who have give you loyalty pisces also i'm trying to find there's something in here like i feel like somebody may have helped you out in the past and you you know how we are if somebody helps us or does something for us we, we give loyalty we'll put the blinders on for that person you know like we're, we're good like that but i feel this energy of do not turn your the blind eye to this person and whatever whatever situation that they're going through they are not themselves um, they may be trying to take advantage of you. They may be holding that favor that they did for you that one time as like the end all be all. And now you need to help them and do something for them. And maybe they may be asking you for money or something along those lines, Pisces. Use discernment. You know, um, people do change. People do things do come over people, maybe others with attachments or other things like that. But I am definitely feeling the energy like this person may not be all there is what I'm feeling. And they still may, may be trying to collect on you for something that they've given you in the past. And that's how I'm feeling that, Pisces. This could definitely involve another party that is telling them that you owe them 
that you should be this way, that things should look this way. And I don't know if that's making any sense because it's not to me, but you know, that's how I'm feeling this energy. Just be very careful. Just because somebody did something for you in the past doesn't mean that you still owe them is basically the energy I'm picking up. All right, Spirit, tell me more about this hermit. The Four of Cups in the reversal. One more. And the Devil. I felt, I know what I felt, Pisces. You guys may still love someone that is not all there or may have an attachment to someone else, you know, and so they're not being themselves. You know, and it's really hard because, you know, like I said, like when you love someone, you love someone hard, you know, but at the end of the day, you got to figure out how, what is this doing to me? How is this affecting my energy? How is this rubbing off on me? Especially if you have a deep bond and a deep connection to this person, you know, like, you know, it's like the example, like with my cousin, like she's attached to a narcissist that affects me. You know, it's an example. It affects me because I love her. And it affects me that someone can, you know, abuse and mistreat her like that. And I feel those feelings as well, you know? So I don't know. That's the, that's the, the example of the feeling that I'm getting here, Pisces, about this situation. You know, maybe you've tried to talk to a person about it. Maybe you tried to help them. You tried to give them some of the wisdom, some of the things that you've learned from your past. And they can't see it is what I'm getting. This could also, it doesn't have to just be about relationships. This could be about work. You may be trying to share your wisdom. You may be trying to, you know, show people how, you know, the mistakes that you've made in your life, you know, and maybe this person is not ready to hear it. You know, that's the feeling that I'm getting. You know, they're not ready to hear it. They need to lose something. They need to lose some type of, um, something that's very toxic in their life in order for them maybe to be able to grasp what you're trying to say. But let's keep going. Spirit, tell me more about this two of swords. Like I felt there like something about like somebody was trying to pull your energy or trying to pull you out of alignment. Yep, page of cups is my crazy card. You know, maybe they're trying to make you feel crazy about something like you did something wrong type of feeling or you're wrong or something. I don't know, Pisces, but that's the feeling like you're crazy. You're crazy is what I'm getting. Right? It says it in the song as well. Right. You're crazy and I'm out of my mind. Yes, right? Um, you're crazy and I'm out of my mind. What I'm getting here, Pisces, is that someone is pulling you away from the things that you're supposed to be doing. You might be, okay, so Eight of Pentacles can be underworking or overworking. You know, and so, and they can both have benefits and they can both have um, bad things about it. Like if you underwork, you don't produce the money you're supposed to make. If you overwork, you may be over exhausting yourself and not really, you know, getting aligned with where you're supposed to be. So sometimes people with their weird energies, with their weird attachments, with their, you know, um, third parties, like somebody else that's affecting them can affect us, especially if you have such a strong bond with them. So I am getting this feeling here, like, you know, silence your mind, try to figure out what your true voices are, because right now you're in this energy of picking up. You're being very receptive to other people and their, their, their problems is what I'm getting. You're being very receptive to it and you have your own is what I'm getting. You have your own issues. You know, my head's underwater, but I'm breathing fine. You know, that's the feeling Pisces, like just be careful. Just because someone's been loyal to you before doesn't mean you have to always be loyal to them is the energy that I'm getting. Let me see if I missed anything. Yeah, focus on your work. You know, uh, don't do too little and don't do too much is the energy that I'm getting there. All right, Spirit, give, give me a little bit more about this devil in reverse. Give me a little bit more. Somebody may be under the influence. When they come out of being under the influence, they'll be able to hear you better. I don't know what influence that may be. That could be another person. There it is, Three of Swords. That's exactly what it is, Three of Swords. When they get their heart broken, then they'll see is what I'm feeling. This person's really going to destroy them. Do we want that for people that we have strong bonds and love to? No. But sometimes it takes a person to break that bad in order for them to understand that you either were just trying to help them 
you know, or that this person was bad. You were trying to give them something from experience is what I get, like really like gems, like things that you've learned. Like you, like I said, you're the old soul of the Zodiac. Like you, even if you haven't experienced it in your life, you have great uh, um, instincts about what you should or should not do. So the feeling that I'm getting here, Pisces, is that what is that called when you just know something? You just know, you know, and you're telling them things about what I, what I feel about this situation. And it's like maybe they're not really being all the way receptive to it, Pisces. They will be receptive to it when their heart gets broken and stomped on and destroyed. And that's unfortunate. But that's what I'm feeling there. This time will pass, Pisces. This person that holds some type of power over someone that you love, it will pass. That's the overall energy that I'm getting. You know, just pour all your love into God. God will pour all his love into you. If you want somebody to be loyal to, be loyal to God. And, and God will show you loyalty like no one else has shown you loyalty before. All right, that's the feeling I'm getting there. You know, something else is coming to mind now, Pisces. Another story about another cousin. Well, today's Cousins Day, I don't know. Anyway, um, let me just shuffle these. So I remember... My cousin was the type of person that he would give a lot to random women. You know, like if he got money, he would, you know, give it to some random women. He got into trouble and he had to go to prison. And he asked these women for help, letters, commissary money, like whatever, stuff like that. Not a single one of them helped him out. But his mom took a bus whenever she could, all the time, because the, the bus ride, it was a long ride to get to where his prison was, and she took it all the time. And his sister was the one putting money in, you know, and sending him clothes, the things he, that he needed. Meanwhile, these women that he was chasing and that he was after, they didn't even send him a pair of socks, Pisces, not even a pair of socks. But he was giving all his stuff to all his money, all his attention. And unfortunately, we were hoping once he came out, he would understand and see who was really there for him. But he did not. He went right back to chasing the women, to giving them everything. You know, he even won some money in the lottery and he didn't give his mother anything. So... You know, it's stuff like that, Pisces. Like, I don't know why that is coming to mind. Um, I don't, honestly, I don't know why I felt the need to tell that story. Maybe there's something there for you guys. But um, something, uh, it's a loyalty thing, Pisces. Like maybe, I don't know, maybe his sister shouldn't have put all that money in there. I don't really know. Maybe his mom shouldn't have wasted her time. But I know it's hard as a mom. You know, I can't even imagine. But I do feel the energy that there is somebody here that disrupts this person, but I do feel like it will go away, especially with that death card. I do feel like you have forces from the other side that do help you, Pisces. I don't really know why that story popped out, but all right. Spirit, tell me more. Like, don't lose yourself. Don't go crazy trying to make, you know, someone change or see something that they can, they're not ready to see. They'll see it when they're ready, basically. They'll see it when they're ready. All right, Spirit, tell me more. The mind in reversal. Give me one more. I think you're in a place of clearing your mind. Transformation. Yeah, I've, I definitely feel like there's been a lot of high stress issues in your life. Like, my head's underwater, but I'm breathing fine. It's like you're, you're being patient in this stressful time. That's what I'm getting. Like, you're being very patient. You're trying to find the courage. You're trying to find the faith, Pisces, to know that everything is going to turn out okay. Like I said, this is a simulation. Things seem like, you know, things are going downhill, but you will be able to transform this situation. Just have the courage just have the patience just find the peace of mind Pisces that's a big one I don't care if you got to do CBD I don't care if you got to do other things figure out how to stay calm in this storm and you will transform it that's how I'm getting this everything will transform for you find the courage Pisces to love on, like the people only that love you back you know and if it's just God at this very moment that's all you need you know, if you pour all your love into him, he will pour all his love into you. And that's how I'm feeling that. Let's do one more. Spirit, give me one more. Give me one more. The rebirth. One more. 
Transformation and rebirth, Pisces. I think a lot of you are not going to be as nice as you used to be. Um, I think people may see that, you know, even if they do do something for you, you're not going to take it like you're going to start realizing that I don't need to be loyal to you just because you did something to me. To me, it's coming off Pisces like maybe these people did it on person on purpose so that you could be in their debt. Maybe there was a narcissist in your life, Pisces, because I did bring up a story about a narcissist and they acted like they were helping you. But in reality, they were trying for you to be indebted to them. But I feel like there's a new person that's coming out, one that's wiser, more knowledgeable. Maybe you're researching things about people and their behaviors. There's some element here of being very psychological, Pisces. Um, so you are changing, you know, um, don't change too hard. Always remain your loving, same, playful self. Um, but at the same time, if you need to be more cutthroat, then be more cutthroat. You understand people's limitations. The, 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 their mind can't expand so much because maybe they have behavioral issues. I do have the page of cups there. There might be some type of behavioral issues is what I'm getting there, Pisces. So the, your point, important key is to just remain, try to remain stress-free. Don't let other people's stresses go on to you. That's the big gist that I'm getting here, Pisces. Um, and I just find the courage to know that all this will pass. Everything will change very soon. People will transform and you will transform this negative energy into something positive. It just takes a matter of time. All right, Pisces, I hope you like the reading. Please like and subscribe and thank you.